Before he became a TikTok sensation known for balancing a speaker on his head while dancing in downtown Guelph. Before he gained over 220,000 followers and 9 million likes on TikTok. Before he collabed with other TikTok stars like City Boy JJ. It's the speaker legend, Long Tendo, Toronto! <laughs> Long Chung, better known as Long Tendo, is a name that resonates with the streets of Guelph. But this journey wasn't something that happened overnight. It all began back in 2015 when a 19-year-old Long decided to take his passion for entertainment to the streets. I'm Jessica Chin King and this is Before They Were Famous. We want to bring back the community on this channel. We have giveaways and contests coming soon. For now, let us know in the comments who to do next and if we pick yours, we will shout you out. Now let's get into the video. Born January 30th, 1997 in Guelph, Ontario, Long carved a niche for himself as a street performer captivating locals and tourists alike with his unique blend of singing and dancing. As you stroll through Guelph's downtown core, you might spot a crowd gathered, drawn by the infectious energy of a performer. That performer is Long, balancing a wireless speaker on his head and spinning it as he busts out some killer dance moves. I started with balancing the speaker on my head and it really has some charm, I guess he said. Initially, he placed the speaker on top of his signature fedora, but soon he discovered that his unique head shake was perfect for balancing, leading him to this now iconic performance style. Long's performances began to catch on. By 2017, he was already seeing love from people as crowds reacted positively to his routines. He perfected his craft, learning how to keep that speaker steady while dancing and even discovered that he could delicately spin it with his finger while moving. It took a lot of practice at home, he admits, but the more I worked on it, the better I got. Fast forward to 2019 and Long took a leap into the world of social media, joining TikTok. His unique content quickly resonated with viewers, leading him to amass a following roughly equivalent to Guelph's population. With an impressive 204.9 thousand followers and 6.7 million likes on TikTok, Long Tendo 225 was born. His videos surpassed 9 million total likes and several have crossed the 2 million views mark. Talk about making a mark. One of the turning points in Long Tendo's career came when Barstool Sports noticed him. A video of his performance went viral, racking up over 500,000 views and introducing him to a broader audience. It felt surreal to have that kind of recognition, he recalls, reflecting on how it encouraged him to push harder with his performances. As he became more recognized, Long's routine began to evolve. He started incorporating running into his performances, yes, running, while balancing a speaker. I had to learn how to keep it from falling off, he laughs. His dedication paid off as he became a local legend even earning shout outs from university students who would stop him on campus and ask for photos and videos. I love it when they want to collaborate on TikTok, he adds. However, recent events have stirred the pot in Long's life and career. An incident involving fellow content creators led to a bunch of rumors and speculation online. During a podcast episode of Burrow Sound, DJ Czar and other creators addressed allegations surrounding a supposed altercation involving Long Tendo. Many believed he was jumped but the reality was much less dramatic. Long had fallen off a scooter and sustained injuries that were misinterpreted as being the result of violence. The creators involved expressed their frustration over how quickly misinformation spreads, stating, people come up with this crazy social media narrative. As soon as one person comments, everyone thinks it's true and that's not the case. They clarified that they were unaware of Long Tendo's accident at the time, emphasizing that they rushed to help him once they learned about it. In addition to this, Long Tendo formed an unexpected connection with fellow content creator City Boy JJ through a mutual friend. City Boy JJ recognized Long Tendo as a known person for his unique speaker performances and quickly became a fan. He humorously clarified that their relationship is purely platonic, emphasizing Long Tendo's interest in women. City Boy JJ expressed admiration for Long Tendo's influence in the content creation scene, praising his ability to innovate by turning simple concepts into engaging content. He encouraged others by highlighting that if Long Tendo could achieve success, anyone could. And he expressed pride in Long Tendo's achievements. Long's unique brand of entertainment has made him a hit, not just with locals, but also with visitors. 
You might find him at events or just on the streets where fans are often eager to capture his performances on their local social media platforms. In fact, students at University of Guelph even painted a landmark cannon in homage to him. Long shares, I was so flattered when I found out it's a cool way to be remembered. With his newfound fame, Long also ventured into voice acting and made his debut on Cameo where fans can request personalized video messages. It's a new avenue for him to connect with his audience and he loves every minute of it. He's also had the chance to meet several other popular TikTok creators and major celebrities like Taylor Swift, Howie Mandel, and Kid Leroy. Despite all this attention, he remains humble. All I care about is entertainment, he states. As Long Tendo's popularity continues to rise, He's also setting his sights on expanding into the film industry. In 2023, he's set to appear in a short film titled Big Sale. He's excited about this new venture and the opportunities that come with it. I want to keep pushing myself, he said. You never know what you can bring into the world unless you try. Reflecting on his journey, Long's advice to aspiring entertainers is simple but powerful. Believe in yourself and just try your best. You never know what you can achieve. He emphasizes the importance of persistence and creativity, especially in today's digital age where everyone has a platform. So what's next for Long Chung? With his infectious personality and commitment to his craft, the sky's the limit. As he continues to grow his brand and entertain audiences, one thing's for sure, Guelph's streets won't be the same without him. Thanks for watching. What do you think about Long Tendo's journey? Have you ever seen him perform? What are your thoughts on the recent incident? Comment down below and let us know. All right, guys, as you know, before they're famous, they've partnered with Mogul Productions, which is allowing you access to Hollywood events and film sets. We're giving you the ability to either crowdfund as an investor or as a creator. And we're talking getting things like producer credits, access to red carpet events, stuff you could never have before. I mean, the Harvey Weinsteins and those guys who ran the world, well, the worst ones are locked away. And with the power of Web3, we're all getting our shot at doing what we love. I mean, you can even get a walk-on role in an upcoming feature film that's gonna be released theatrically. There's no more Hollywood gatekeepers because Mogul Productions, well, they're making your Hollywood dreams a reality. And it's all through the power of Web3 and a tight-knit community. And we're also working with musical acts like Rello Renzano. Have you heard of them? Well, we just released his Before They Are Famous video, which included an in-depth interview. Take a look. So can you tell us about your journey into music and what inspired you to become a musician? Oh, uh, I don't even know. So for this project here, well, Mogul Productions, they've teamed up with Rello for his debut album release, Can't Escape the Allure. Now, this isn't just like your average album launch. It's a revolutionary opportunity for early supporters to share in Rello's success, earning a portion of the album's profits. And trust me, I interviewed him. This guy's going places. He's got the look. He's got the talent. He's even got some flavor. Mm, I'm rooting for him. Now to make things even more interesting, well, Mogul is doing a token airdrop for those who want to get involved with this project and start investing in Mogul Productions. Now, what you need to do is you go over and sign up for the whitelist that's at zealy.io. And once you've done that, well, you leave a comment on one of the Before They Were Famous videos where you say done and your Zealy username. And that way, well, you'll be entered to win Mogul Tokens. Now, these are going to allow you to spend some coin on future campaigns, like being a walk-on actor in a future movie. Heck, if you win one of those, I'll even go with you. I want to be in movies as well. Now, we got tons of collaborations and projects we'll be working on via Mogul in the future, and we update you at the end of every Before They Are Famous video, so be sure to stay tuned because we're going to be announcing new stuff each and every week. All right, till then, I'll see you guys in another video.